Hey y'all, welcome back to the Artsy Studio. First of all, I uh, cut my hair. <laughs> I cut quite a bit of it off and I think it's like really cute, honestly. We have some wrapping to do. I did all of the stamping. Look how adorable. So cute. Um, I stamped all the paper, including some paper for the butterfly because I'm really, I can't cross my fingers without like forcing them to cross. Anyway, I'm really crossing my fingers that someone will, will snag the butterfly before tomorrow. So we are gonna begin packing, well, we're gonna wrap everything. Actually, you know what we should do? Is wrap the rugs in plastic first. Should I wrap it all, all of them in plastic? Why not? Yeah, I think I'm gonna do it. I don't know. Sorry about that. <laughs> I got one of those uh, walking pads so I'm very eager to get it. How cool would it be to edit my videos while I'm walking? Although I do feel like I don't know if I have the balance <laughs> to be able to do a, do a walk while I'm editing. I'm not really sure, but I am gonna try. We should do one at a time. We should do one at a time. It's gonna be kind of weird to pack up the pillows, but I don't know, I'm gonna do my best, I guess figure it out. I've already messed up. No! You little Stay over there. All right, I may need to get my big table out again. Look at this room right now. <laughs> Doo, doo, doo. Oh, you guys are still watching. That's great. Look how cute. I can't get over when I look at like when I look at the viewfinder. Um, I really got to find a wide angle lens because I originally when I originally got this camera, you know, I was doing I was doing different style of videos. So I really wanted to be able to zoom in. Look how far in. Great lens for that, but I need it to be wider. I need you to kind of be like set back further so you can see more. Oh, I'm not gonna have to do like multiple passes for this one. Nice. Look how satisfying that is. Just like a big burrito. Little burrito, that's what I meant. Because we've got big burritos. I don't know why, but whenever I like have one of them wrapped, <laughs> I like to toss it around. It just feels so satisfying. Like nothing's gonna happen to this. The strawberry and all of her. Beautiful, perfect glory. There we go. Little straw. This one is so exciting. Look at that. So safe and sound and perfect. Big burrito. All right, I'm done with the plastic wrap, thankfully. This, <laughs> this is one of the pillows. I feel like it looks like a, a parcel, which is usually what I'm going for. Like an old timey parcel. Does, I don't know, doesn't it kind of look like that? A package from a, a movie? So I've wrapped a couple of the pillows, but I still have this one and then the wall hangings and the two rugs to still do. Look how cute this is. Look how cute this is. Okay. 
You know what I'm saying? Look how cute. Nice. Y'all, look at this. All of them are packed up and ready for you guys to open them. I just... <laughs> I love whenever I have everything like packed up for my drop, I like to set them all up and just look at them. <laughs> look how cute they are. All ready to go. All right, I'm gonna pack them up, um, but I need to put like their their addresses on them, so I will see you later. <laughs> hey y'all, it's, uh, it's actually the next day. Um, Sean and I were just running to the post office, and literally right when we parked <laughs> at the post office, the butterfly rug sold. So we ran home because I wanted to get it out um, at the same time as everything else on Friday, since we were there anyway. Um, so we ran back home, which was like five minutes, so it's not a big deal, um, to come get the butterfly rug so I can send it out with everything else. How exciting. A sold out drop. I haven't had that since um, the Halloween drop. Or How many drops have we had? This is the fourth. Third? Fourth. I'm not really sure. Sold out drop. <laughs> uh, okay, let's. we're going to go to the post office now. I feel like it's uh, it's been like 10 years since I talk to y'all it feels like an entire week has gone by but then again it was my weekend so there's only three days anyway um all packages have gone out actually today being monday a lot of them should be getting delivered today oh my gosh though the the post office that we went to was like a newer one obviously since we moved so we went to a, a closer one and so like i you know we, the the person that was helping me wasn't familiar with not that not that anybody like knows who i am if that makes sense that uh, that's not a thing for me um what i mean is that oh yeah no i don't need extra this and no i'm i'm going with you know this shipping option and like the people at the post office before like kind of remembered everything so it would kind of go really fast and i didn't have to answer so many freaking questions um but yeah the person that was helping me this time asked me every single time which is what they're supposed to do i'm not at all saying like they did anything wrong i was just scaring me <laughs> i was just like stressed and then one of them one of the packages was like just slightly differently priced than I than I had put in than I thought it would be. So I just chose the shipping option that matched around that price. I ended up paying a little bit more still, but I wanted it to match more than than be less. Oh, gosh, I'm not explaining this right. Anyway, so I had to fill out this extra form. I had to put some different info on there. So if you, uh, I know who it is, and I I know that they'll they'll be fine. <laughs> they'll be cool about it. <laughs> Just information that I wouldn't want. You know. Anyway, if uh, you're the one that got that package, then um, I would appreciate it if you kept all info to yourself. I know that you will. Anyway, we are. Oh my gosh. I, you know, I'm gonna drag this one out just a little bit, this video, because later today I am getting more embroidery, what do you call it? Stabilizer. Um, but I got a sticky kind. So I have like a regular, like the white regular looking stuff. It's the tearaway kind. But I just recently got some like clear sticky kind because we are going to do the thing that y'all always suggest to me, which is embroidering straight onto the hats. I looked up some videos. Well, sheesh, I'm just being hella rude. Road rage is wild. Like, calm down. <laughs> what was I saying? Oh, I watched some videos, I watched some tutorials about how to embroider straight onto a hat. It does look very easy. Some of y'all were like, you're gonna be astounded at how easy it is to do that. That's what we're gonna do later. This, I can't wait. I can't wait to try it because I think it's actually gonna work. I was like, oh my gosh, I am astounded <laughs> at how easy this looks because the, the clear like sticky stabilizer I got is a like wash away kind. I think this is all gonna go perfectly great. 
uh, but we are going to test it on one of my own beanies so that I don't waste a beanie. I did a huge bulk order for beanies. I think I got like 36 beanies. They're on their way now, but yeah, I'm very, I'm excited. Anyway, so what we are going to do is the final color of the flowers. Alright, all the flowers are tufted on there, and so I don't have um, my packages yet. So I went around the back and I was kind of like getting nervous about how, um, just how puffy they are and floofy. They're just like big puff balls, but you'll see this orange one here. I went ahead and carved this one because I, I wanted to see <laughs> if honestly one I was gonna see if it's it was easier to carve while it's still like hanging on the frame and the answer is yes I feel like this would be really difficult to carve like laying down on it especially with like the moss like lumps that we're gonna have I think this would be really difficult to carve the flowers not on the frame so glad that I tried this I'm gonna go ahead and carve this pink one I I'm having such a hard time not just like buying that freaking GoPro. The GoPro. I like if I could just strap you all to my head and you guys could have the perfect view. It's actually driving me crazy. All right, here is the pink one carved. Look how cute it is. Like, we go from something wild and crazy like that to this. <gasps> Look how cute they are. Yeah, they're uh, they're pretty dang adorable. I'm so glad that I did the flowers as like 3D as well. I think this, this rug is gonna be so cool. Hey y'all, it's the next day. Um, my stuff didn't come in, so sorry about that. My stuff didn't come in until late, so yeah, it's the next day. Anyway. This is what I got. It's a new bra thread. <laughs> anyway, sticky water soluble paper stabilizer. Okay, so I think I can peel this. Wow, it's very sticky. My piece is a little big. It's okay. Okay. Wow. That's pretty nice, because now I don't like have to pin it or anything. So I'm also gonna make sure that I, so this is the side that we're embroidering on, and I need to make sure that this side is also lifted, which also has a sheet of stabilizer on the back. But yeah, I need to make sure that this is all kind of like uncovered so that we don't uh, embroider it shut. <coughs> Let's do heart eyes ghost. So I'm, I really like that. And then I also have to rotate it so that it's facing that way. And edit. And then we're going to start. <laughs> oh, I'm nervous. So it's going to take nine minutes.
looks like we're done. Okay, I think I'm just gonna like cut the excess off. Okay, and then this back one, we should be able to just tear it off. Oh, cool. I've actually never used it this way. <laughs> I'm gonna bring you over to my my bathroom. <laughs> We're gonna try to dissolve the rest of this paper. Okay. Um magic happened. It's really just gone. A large part of me thought that that was not gonna wash away, um, but it did. So if we flip this right side out again, it's upside down. <laughs> but I've learned a lesson here. <laughs> That's actually hilarious. Oh my God. Okay. <laughs> it's upside down. But it, it would have worked if I knew about this, you know, and I'm sure some of you did while watching that. But what we tested here worked. That is, that's what we need to focus on, okay? This is my own hat. I don't care that it's upside down. But like I said, I've learned this lesson now, and now I'm not going to do this to, like, I'm not going to waste one of y'all's hats. I'm not going to ruin a different hat that isn't mine. I do wish it could be, like, closer to like the center. Maybe I'll try to like get it as close to the edge as possible. But now I know that I don't want it to face that way when it's embroidering, right? I want it to face towards this side. Valuable, valuable lessons were learned today. But does this not look pretty great? Like it's just on the hat now. It's not, it's not like an embroidered patch. It's just on there. And the back also looks really good. I don't know, I think it's pretty cute. I'm trying to think of what it looks like. It looks like, maybe like, a, like if you squint really hard, do you see maybe like a person with a crown and then the, the hearts are still their eyes, but it's just upside down. So now this is their chin. And this is like the hair or the crown. Kind of reminds me of Midna from Zelda. That could be cute. I like that. All right. Uh, first of all, excuse the look. I just got off the treadmill before doing this. So some valuable lessons were learned. <laughs> that sticky stabilizer, because all of the other videos I saw were people pinning some like regular stabilizer to the top. And I was like, that looks awful to have to do that. So YouTube has this new, like, um, how do you say? It is like, an affiliate mm, program to like link products in your videos so that it it's like easier for y'all to find. I know that I put links down in the description, but I do still get comments about like, where can I find this? I don't know how it's gonna like look on the video, but I think I'm gonna try it out. Um, so anything that might like might pop up as like a, a product in the video, um, it will probably be like an affiliate thing. So if you're not into anything like that, then you totally don't have to click on it. Hopefully it'll like show you what it's called. And then if you really don't wanna like click on the affiliate like link for it, you can at least search it for yourself. And what I mean by affiliate is that I will get like a commission, I think. Yeah, I'll make a commission if y'all like buy something through my affiliate link with the product. Do you know what I mean? I don't know. It's kind of like kind of confusing because the links that I have down in the description, if they're from Amazon, they are also affiliate links. So I think you could do either or. It might just be easier if you don't mind using affiliate links and if you want to help me out to use the ones that like pop up on the screen. Again, I don't know what it's going to look like and I just kind of wanted to like let you know. I don't want it to just like start out of nowhere and you guys be like, what is this? And not know that I'm putting those there. Does that make sense? I'm not going to go crazy with it. Like, this ball of yarn this is where I got this and this ball of yarn. Do you know what I mean? I'm not going to go wild and crazy. We're just going to see how it goes. I hope that's okay. <laughs> but yeah, I'll try to link like my sewing machine, like my embroidery sewing machine, and then like the stabilizers. If I can, I'll link like 
my tufting machine maybe? I don't know, we'll see. Anyway, I'm definitely gonna end this video here. I hope this wasn't an eternity. Thank y'all so much for watching this video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. Make sure you give this video a like and subscribe to my channel and leave a comment down in, in the description. Eh. Leave a comment down below. It really helps out my channel. You can follow me in all of these places. It is usually at Artsy Madwoman besides Twitch and Tumblr, which is the Artsy Madwoman. Oh, really quick. Thank y'all so much for um another sold out drop. Another successful, wonderful drop. I'm so... It's sold out. It's completely sold out. It's nice and cute and I love y'all very, very, very much. Um... If you're somebody that got something and you've already received it, I know that some people got theirs yesterday. One person got theirs on Saturday, which is pretty great. Anyway, um, if you've already received the thing that you got, let me know what you think. <laughs> I'm very excited. It's just crazy. You know what I mean? It's just wild and crazy that I get to do this and Every drop has been so great. I'm just so grateful. You know, this is this is the dream for me. This is the dream. <laughs> Next drop is going to be pretty interesting, I feel like. I'm hoping to have three or four sets of crocheted lights. Three are going to be different colored um, flower lights like mine. One <laughs> is going to be, well, maybe I should say that for like a surprise for when we work on it a little bit more. I'll save it. One is gonna be special. If you follow me on Instagram, you may have seen me talk about it on my stories. But anyway, I'm just excited to keep doing this. I'm so, I'm so ridiculously grateful. Gone through a lot of changes recently and I'm just so happy. I'm genuinely just happy. Anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna let you go. I love y'all. To absolute death, oh, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.